This is Jeremiah Kujiram again from Kokoko, Ghana in Toronto. I'm here with my main man, Mr. G again, and I'm back to what we were talking initially. Mr. G, like we talking earlier, why do you think there's a big difference between the youth, the way they behave and the, and the, and the demeanor of Montreal and those in Toronto? Is there like a big problem? And then if so, what is it? Like I said, we, we have respect or go. Toronto, I want to respect. Toronto, I want to You know, like, we, like I said, we want to guide them. You go up, everybody go up with respect. Respect your this, respect your that. And if you want to be bothered, you go to sit up there that line, go with you. You know what I mean? And don't get some of no respect. It's just like a whole space, everybody run off in the head. Run around with their head cut off, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? I said, so, you know what I mean? Me personally, I ain't gonna trust nobody in her life. See me, I said, mm -hmm. and they have good people and bad people. Um, why do you think it is so in Toronto? Is this because of the system? And if the system, which part of the system do you think the problem is? You know, no, Toronto wasn't meant to be, never start as a city. Toronto was Pierre Bush and Cole Fast and Abilo. Montreal was built as a city, so it more like a compact of the city. Yeah, because Scar, of the island. Scar, more like an island. Even at one Montreal, everything from there come here because the French changed and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it was like, it was like, we a city. Mm -hmm. Some city more, you know what I mean? Yeah, more but more. at the same time, yeah, Christian blood down here. We don't even have Christian blood in Montreal. Just to show you. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah you see yeah, the last time. Like, you know what I mean? Like, our kind of way of growing up before was different. We are serious to what we do. Yeah, you were talking about this Christian blood thing, and then the difference between a gangster and something that you're saying. Yeah, yeah. Um, a gangster and what else were you talking about again? Well, like I said, you know, you have people who are still, I mean, like, you have the gangsters, and you have the... You have the bad man. And bad man. Yeah, you know what I mean? You might have seen bad and what you want. And what the right? difference? Well, yeah, so we might just try to understand. My days are to them, I put it in a different way. My days, they always a real gangster. Like, they are real pink, them those, they real this, no, they. Look around now. In my days, nobody like a kid couldn't carry guns. Seriously, so a big difference? So, no, 14, 15, you're gonna walk around with a gun down a big man here, but you must have lied. So, so carrying a gun means you're a big man? No, 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 that's a matter of show you. These mentality of these kids nowadays, you know, gangsters. Nowadays, gangster life was like, you're going to make money, you do you want to do this, okay. You know what I mean? Just, you know, you're like, and if I kill people, you know what I mean? There's no protection still. But these, these kids now, they don't care to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right, all right, let me show you. Every time you see somebody die, you might get shot. You ever hear say money in, in Robin Man get a million dollars? No. You say rob a car in the store, you ain't get a few. You understand what I'm trying to say? They always do something. Oh, 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 something foolish. Oh, why shoot the man because he's looking at me? Oh, yeah. Because he may he talk to my girl. Okay, so in that case, is that person a gangster or just a bad no. boy? No, no, bad boy. He did too. I mean, he did. Yeah, I'm gonna say, but can you see the thing about it? Don't teach me like this. Anything you do will be good in it. Mm hmm. You understand good or bad? That means they ever make some more of it. So I'm trying to say to you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. You know, so never least kid in my days I yeah, I kid who in the game I didn't want to do. You understand me? Couldn't call him lawyer and pay them out in their own pocket. Never these kids nowadays can't even call him lawyer and call him parents. Yes. Look, um, um do you think technology plays a big part in it? Yeah, that's a big thing, guys. You think so? Yeah. Because, all right, look around right now, just around. We, we, we have ten, we just, uh, just walk into our office nowadays. Walk into our office 25 years ago, 30 years ago. What do you see? What's the difference? You see people. You go to the office nowadays, you see computers. Yeah, machines, yeah. But I mean, what does that got to do with the community and the youngsters turning? Many of them can't get no jobs. If you go, if you have experience, you say you can't get no experience. Um, they can't get a steady job and make call me go to agency and then you have them young. What do you want the kids to do? Look around you. Okay. Did you have that those days? 
I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Yeah, but no, what I mean is, did, did you have the jobs then? Yeah, man, it was job crazy. Jobs everywhere. You could tell a boss, if you don't go next door, we'll get another job. No problem. Even if, you know what I mean? I used to work at McDonald's and those places, but I mean, there was just job. You, you understand what I'm trying to say to you? Another thing again, too. But for these kids, them, you see, it's not the kids and fault. They just this is their time. Right? You see the music change, the dancing change, right. everything change. What used to be in a bedroom is outdoor now. Yes. You know, so it's, you can't blame them. Cause they go, you see them go up and see something different. And then, and then also, I know you're very, very passionate. I know you're very passionate about this gay business. One fire upon that. Um, not being too obscene or anything. What is your real opinion in terms of what President Barack Obama recently endorsed, saying um, he's okay with gay marriage? All right, but I like to something to a gay man. See, simple like this. I'm not here answer and answer. I mean, I said to him, I said, are you believing having, I uh, believe in family? I mean, I like to hear answer. He said, yes to me. So I mean, I said, where you going to be the next, my favorite next family fan? If you believe in family. We are not believing in a gay thing. People are not doing it because of them born gay. Screw that. I'm mean, see people do things. You want to see the man to see the man tomorrow and do what they want to do. Mm -hmm. Nobody the born gay. Because they can't do it, no one gets away with it. Because, alright. Where do you suffer gay man together? Where my bill? Any picnic I come? <laughs> no. What, what the hell is mm -hmm. If you put all the money together and start together, okay, I'm man, 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 gay. They, that's what done. Nothing building from there. Women in my top one of my lesbian and this and that. Everyone in my man they cash hold on. Everyone in my man they cash up in the den. Um do you think uh, uh, do you think um being a homosexual male or homosexual is different from being le I mean uh, the the way people perceive is different from being lesbian? You know, you know what I mean? I think there are more people who accept lesbians than homosexuals. That the males. Am I right? Well, no, Miss you know, you know so Wait, let me tell you, man. You see, right now, we can't talk for me. Let me see the rule of one. Yeah, yeah, even yeah, the man, yeah, yeah, even the pastor, I want to teach. I don't want to let me say the one who's supposed to do you must say the right thing to you, like a church. And all the teachers who teach you the right thing, and they might pretty fire that thing. You understand know what I mean? Yeah. So, right now, like me, I said, we can't talk for me. But. If you're about to man a lesbian and control the whole world, like I'm saying, I'm a 14 year old kid to my gay. What you know about 14 year old gay? 10 year old? <laughs> because, then, yo, alright. <laughs> when did that thing talk again? We uh -huh. messed up. Any black man talking about this, they better get, get a check enough for them. You understand? 99% of them get a check in on themselves. The black man talk about how relationship is this and that. You understand what I mean? Half of your relationship already. Mm -hmm. Yeah, even many days have a girl and a girl say, Oh man, baby, horny man, I can't wait till you come. Mm -hmm. Those days are done. Women appear themselves and they vibrate you before you come, you come and taste them and they move them more. <laughs> you talking to show your change? <laughs> yeah. I'm not talking to you, because you're blazing a fire. I think that's a thing. So, you understand where I come from? Oh, oh, okay, so, 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 so you think a woman doing that is the same as being gay or lesbian? She's not gay or lesbian, and doing no one for the book, right? You see, you're not for the man, okay? You're gonna, she's gonna be with a woman. But, same part for a part of part, you're doing what you're doing, 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 what you're you understand what I'm trying to say? Right. So, them do it because them can't do it and get away with it. But if they could not do it, and they're not dead tomorrow, they're not going to do it. Like if you tell them I'm going to jump off of the building right now, I'm going to I'm going to do it? No. But because people can't do what they do now, and get away with it. You're right. There's nothing to do with no, no, in, in bang, gay, yeah, wait, wait. I'm going to get to them and say, you know what? If you like to fuck a man no more, I'm going to fuck a man and do it. If you like to fuck a man, I'm going to fuck a man because they can't do it. Yeah. But if it was a policy, if you fuck a man, you're dead right away. You think that, 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 if I take a jump off the building, you're gonna do it? <laughs> you see what I'm trying to say to you? So people know no, what, okay, okay, what okay. you want to do. Okay, so on a very serious, serious note now, Mr. G. Um, do you think it's right for a country like Zimbabwe or Uganda to persecute and even in, uh, imprison gays and lesbians? 
What's your opinion about? I mean, politically and morally, you know. Well, we know. Uh, put it like this. Put it like this. I like can't put up with a lesbian. One or one reason, because no matter what, no man can have kids. They can multiply. Okay, if you take out, if you take out the case, if you take out the case, okay, nobody because there are sometimes where you have head, 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 heterosexuals, you know, a man and a woman who they can purposely decide they don't want kids or they may not be able even to have kids well, right so i mean in a situation like that how is it different from two women who cannot have kids or two men who cannot have kids because a woman can get grass grass perm and get perm push up in there and get picnic we don't have money for car and still have kids but the one here to not find my tech wrong all right we are the right she can help your man finish perm and put in a heart and still have a family wrong all right true but the man can do Oh, that's what I'm saying. So, okay, so you think it's okay to be lesbian? No, I never said okay. No, 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 no regular life that nobody knows they are being you know for them to go on with their lives and um um go have have a job i mean i'm talking maybe maybe even okay, i think it's going to be a little funny for you, but maybe even going to the extent of being a transvestite all right you want to know the quick answer for this yeah man i mean i respect none of them I'm not seeing you, sir, none of them. And if Master got any one man to go fuck, man, who will make a woman straight up. So, I said, so, I'm going to see nowadays. In the ideas, you're about gays and in the classic and you're about it. Look for these people nowadays, they're gay. They're not no gays, they do because they want to. Do you think kids today feel the same way you feel? Because the TV. They think it's something you, I'm not telling you, you know. They say kids do when I kids are grow up, I grow up and I learn. Like a young, you know, when you're young, you learn what you see. So, some of them kids, I'm going say something good. They think, them, come on, man, they say kid, monkey see, monkey do. <laughs> so, some of these kids sit down on TV and say, oh, man, I see and maybe some of I don't want to try it. Come on, we are in real life. No, 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 yeah, I hear you. you know, know, yeah. Thing, so yeah, yeah. Some of these kids don't know the best, real difference. They get up every day and watch the TV and say, man, fuck a man. In their mentality, what you want to do? Fuck a man, too, right? Just to show you. That's what you go up and see. You know what I mean? I never go up and know about them things and I and I see. Okay, oh, no, okay. And another thing I want to touch again. Mm. The bleaching thing. Uh huh. That's confusing. Confusing <laughs> boy. Because I want to work. I want to hear myself a question. Why? A black people can a bleach out them skin, complexion, fear that complexion. But, 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 you know why? You know, but, 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 what you have to realize is, it's not only black people who are uh, who bleach. Indians bleach too. Hold on, man. You see the black Indians, some of them do bleach. Yeah, but when you're black, you're black. You're not care if you want Indian. When you're black, you're black. But when you're black, when you come black complexion, you want to change. If you want Indian, and you want Chinese. When you're black, and you look like a black man, but I'm, I'm not just a mentality, right? You meet a girl right now, she, she's brown skin, nice. You know she bleach. Mm. Yeah, black. Yeah, people with that beat come on, black. Right. Yeah, I'm coming from my side. All right, pause one day. She got the money. Can't buy a beating. Can't make money. But she didn't want a black man. Yeah, let's see a moment. <laughs> oh, oh, she's sick and she goes to the hospital and she can't use the blink. She comes out like a dead person. Yo, you see? You know why? Would you drink pie and you say you're gonna die? Would you drink the pies and then you know say so you're gonna die? No. No, no, no. Because then do it and can't get away with it. Because they put that pine skin and they put that skin and put it back on them skin. True. That's what I show you. People nowadays now do things because they're wary. They do things because, oh, 
my friend did that go out that do it or it's tired you know what I mean I ask so much of them about to uh, say thank you almighty father for this day or anything like that then what about them here mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you understand what I mean 90 percent of these man over days we send my woman at about how many days if you see your man over there say your baby a child look a relationship oh what you can't do for me mm -hmm. give me the money yeah that's um, what I mean um I need to go shopping no one of them will look for you when you go you know baby mm -hmm. you know, you know, let me go cook for you they can't cook you can't even wash everyone on the wear none of them will wear none you know as a reality man keep me right now because none of them things say uh, open them leg and that make a life no a life is the, the, the way you think, your mind, your heart, what you want out of life. You understand me? Because any woman can open them leg. Mm -hmm. Any woman can get a man. Mm -hmm. Keep one now. Mm -hmm. And the one who can't keep a man, yeah, have a husband. And 99% of the girl and the one they have to be the father. But don't you think it's the same? Don't you don't think it's the same as you know, the other way around too? Let me tell you. For men too? You see, a man, a man different, you know. Cause I'm man who want to do anything and do anything. But you see, in life, you remember back in reality, you know, a woman cannot be a man no matter what she try to do. You understand me? Vice versa, man yeah. can never be a woman too. Yeah, you understand what I try to say to you? But these women in nowadays, I think they get the mentality of wrong with women. We do the, the dual, car. both man and woman. You understand what I mean? Car. Ask her what, what, what do you mean of love? We have some can tell you. Because you're having and then you have none, you understand what I mean? And it's always let's start with the black race right now. The like car we have to put the panel like it's at the we are at the bottom of the food chain. You understand what I mean? Yeah, so true. look around there's so much black woman you see. Like three, four different people, four different baby father. Alright. Look around the Chinese. Obviously with the husband, the Indian with the husband. Mm -hmm. Maybe one, two, you know. Alright. How much of this black woman you don't like to compare? You know you're not gonna make it because when you say something, start you argue and talk. Yeah. <laughs> you understand me? Big mouth. Big. That's my so. And them not come to you and say, yo, baby, well, I meet that man in other man, I've got to cut that line up. Why well, you know what? I don't like men up in a business that we can perform one cent with fifteen dollar and make it that one dollar and penny, you know? Mm. No, they want a few dollars and they try to tell our black men cheap and black man. When you turn around to them and say, your friend, give me a let me a ten dollar and I'll make you a ten dollar. Then now tell them I have it. Yeah. But I expect you to go pull hundred dollars from wherever you can get it from. Is there a government ever cut them off for welfare <laughs> and child support? <laughs> you don't see, you don't know what happened. You don't know what happened. You know what I mean? Uh -huh. yeah. Well, I saw you going so next time I'm blazing more fire. Yeah. So Jerry, 2012. So we say. Thank you so much, Mr. G. Thank you.